as we continue playing Human Fall Flat on the PC, as always, it is your friend Arachnid Soul. This is part two. If you have not watched part one, pause this, go check that out, and Beverly, hold my coals. Now we're in the desert biome. It's a little bit different than what we did in the first episode, which I'm hoping you've seen. Once again, this game is also available on the Xbox One and the PlayStation 4. If we would have picked up that little yellow thing there on the right, there would have been a tutorial video that came up, but I'm skipping that. And as we discussed in the first video, this is a character model that I custom made for this game. You can design any character you want. The character I've decided to play through thus far in this game is the Democratic Socialist from Vermont, Bernie Sanders, a man who ran for president and got screwed by the DNC back in 2016, if you will, but I digress. And now we're seeing the pull-ups being implemented into the game. There's actually another tutorial here. Let's lay out for it. Climbing higher. To get even higher, you need to jump before grabbing the edge. Raise your hands running toward the obstacle. Jump to grab the edge. Lower your hands pulling yourself up. Walk forward releasing the hands. Practice timing and use the momentum. If you don't release hands, you will make a fool of yourself like saying goodbye, shaking hands and walking away without releasing your hand. Etiquette says never do that. We talked a little bit about that mechanic in the first video in this series, but yeah, I'm playing with the, the mouse. I'm deciding not to play with the controller, another thing we talked about. And with the mouse, your right and left clicks do operate your right and left hands. And then you just pull the mouse back a little bit and that's how you do pull-ups. You tend to follow wherever your hands go in this game. So if you look up and then you reach out with the hand, your hand's gonna reach up. And it looks like if we push this train car out of the way or pull it, it's gonna open up the rest of the level. There's multiple ways to solve all of these puzzles. So I think what it wanted me to do was pull that train cart completely and then go through the gap to get to the other part of the level, but I've decided that I'm just gonna climb up that way. And now we're gonna run and make a jump for it, and hopefully this pays off and we can actually make it. Nice, barely got it, but got it. I can tell the game wants me to go to the left, but I'm not going to because I see something interesting over here. I keep smashing my head into the ground every time I pull myself up. So here's a rope, and I know that the game wants me to go right and to go down those mountain cliffs over there. I'm not going to do it. We're going to risk our lives here. We're going to try to use this rope. Hopefully it works. Yeah, I'm picking it up. It seems like it's going to work. I can only imagine playing this with co-op. I have a friend and I kind of turned her on to this game. She's playing it with her boyfriend now. And I think they just go through and try to kill each other. Can we make this? Got it. See, even the Slovakian judge is giving us a 9.8 on that landing. Looks like we have some kind of seesaw type mechanic here. I'm not sure I even need to go over here. See how high I can reach? There you go. You always want to reach up and get as close to the ledge as you can because it is possible that if you don't reach up high enough, you won't be able to grab the ledge. Don't even think I need to go over here, but we're going to try to make this. Nope. And can I pull myself up there? Yeah, I somehow did. pull this off the tracks and it's stuck but I think that's all we're supposed to do so let's try to go back the way we came I highly recommend anyone out there who has not played this game even if you're not really into puzzle games or really into physics give this game a try this is not one of those frustrating puzzle games where things are impossible and you'll never make it through you'll actually be able to figure it out I'm gonna try to get behind this red train car. Oh my God. See, climbing on this game is really not something that you can do like left over right and you get a little bit higher. No, I'm not getting frustrated at all, Beverly. This is perfectly fine. Son of a... 
come on. No, no, I'm, I'm fine, I'm fine. Are you f Bernie! Come on, dude, this is New Hampshire, you got it! Okay, you know what, we're gonna speed this up, we'll be back in a second. Got him, coach! Almost. Finally, okay. So we're through that. Generally, I don't have situations on this game where I get stuck quite like that, but it happened. Hopefully everyone enjoyed that. Oh, now we introduced the pole mechanic. Very nice. Do not like this. Never a fan of glass tables. That Seinfeld episode with Kramer. TV of the 1%. And I think we're gonna wrap it up here. We've made it through this level. Go back for the ninth time I'm gonna tell you again. Watch the first video if you have it. And also, like I said in the first video, tell me which character, which famous person you want me to design. Looks like we're on a construction level here. And we will be back next time with one of those characters and not Bernie Sanders. Check out my Twitter, at ArachnidSoul. And I thank you all for watching and supporting this channel. And I will catch you girls, you guys, and everyone else out there later.